Hello, I'm Nancy Bauer, the Ex Associate Director of Twin Cities Medical Society and the Twin Cities Medical Society Foundation. Joining me today is Linda Vukulich, who's the Executive Director of the Minnesota Psychiatric Society and the Minnesota Mental Health Community Foundation. I've invited Linda to join us to describe the Fast Tracker Program, um, a program that the Minnesota Mental Health Community Foundation established in 2012. And the Twin Cities Medical Society Foundation has been a supporter or a partner of this program since its launch. So Linda, welcome. Thank you. Please explain to us what, Feast, what Fast Tracker is and how this service is benefiting the patients, families, and providers in our community. Thanks so much. I would be happy to. Um, so Fast Tracker is our online referral system. It's an online database that is actually represents uh, a relationship with and a partnership with the mental health provider community and everyone who's looking for services, whether you're calling from an office or as a family member or as an individual who's looking for um, needed services and information about mental illness and substance use disorder. And we, um, we are open source, so you don't have to have an account or anything to go and search for services, but it's also a tool for the provider community so if you're in a, a, a primary care clinic or a psychiatric clinic or any other service provider clinic that um, helps patients find some, some uh, resources for their mental illness or their substance use and um, is having a hard time with that, it's a, it's a tool for those, um, those purposes as well. So we have grown from 2012. We are about to launch our version four and we're very excited because um, we have done a lot with help from the Twin Cities Medical Society uh, throughout the years. It's been a, a splendid partnership really, and um, a nice um, bridge to the medical community to make sure that we're all on the same page and all helping each other out. And uh, we've been growing in terms of um, recognition, in terms of traffic and we're excited to see what the future will bring. Um, can you describe a little bit more about what the services are, the actual services that Fast Tracker um, uses? Definitely, definitely. So if somebody is uh, looking for um, psychiatric providers or for substance use disorder treatment programs, um, you can go online and just punch in a keyword or choose a drop box or I mean a drop down. And um, you can also search by insurance companies, by geographic area, and also by availability. And the availability piece is what's really unique because within um, mental health services, we ask our partners in the community to update their information at least every two weeks. And with those substance use programs, we know it's life or death for people who are ready for services to get in that day. And so we ask our uh, provider community, the, the substance use dis disorder program people to update their information daily. And we're proud to say that 75 to 85% of the information that has been updated has been updated within those timelines. And so when you look online, you're going to find information that you can count on for that day to help yourself or to help the patients and family members who need that information. Wow, that's terrific. Terrific. Yeah. Okay, so let's say you had all the money resources at your fingertips. What is your vision for expanding the Fast Tracker program? Well, thanks a lot. Thanks in, uh, in large part to the help we've gotten with promotional um, expertise and access to um, support for outreach and marketing and that kind of thing through the Twin Cities Medical Society and others. We have grown our um, I think our recognition to the point that we are, are working with a number of statewide groups and we've been having um, some success with some national and federal um, outreach. And it is starting to become a clear possibility that, that Fast Tracker and Minnesota could become a model for the country in terms of a tool that the state can share together to serve their people. Wow, wouldn't that be great? Yes, fingers crossed. We're going to keep pushing for that. 
What a terrific resource to the community. Well, thank you, Linda. Um, appreciate your time. And certainly we appreciate the this um, program from the Minnesota Mental Minnesota Mental Health Community Foundation. It's a, it's yeah. a mouthful to get it all out. <laughs> it is, it is. I just tell people fasttrackermn.org. Perfect, perfect. All right. Thank you so thank much. Thank you Linda. so much. Thank you for the partnership. Absolutely, bye.